Hey guys! So today's an unboxing video and today I am unboxing my Kira Kira crate although it's a uh, pretty battered and you can't freaking tell and uh, I also had to play customs and you guys know how I feel about customs now Kira Kira crate is a Japanese beauty box and of course I will leave the links down below it's by the uh, same people who do the Doki Doki crate and this is April's box now because I had to pay customs I think this is the I don't know actually I mean if you're in the UK and you subscribe to Kira Kira Crate and you've had to pay customs let me know down below in the comments because if this keeps happening I may unsubscribe because uh, this is this is not cool having to pay customs and all that but anyway enough talk let's see what's inside alrighty now hopefully the stuff inside will be good enough to make me not sad about having to pay custom fees, but let's see. <laughs> Can't, oh my god, I already have, I got a hair in here already, wow. Okay, kind of knocked about all over the place, let's find the leaflet, it's here. Oh wow, this um, oh, this leaflet looks super cute, as you can see it's issue 06, April, and it'll tell me everything about what's inside. Oh, hey guys! Okay, okay, okay. What's inside? But obviously I don't want to know just yet because I don't want to spoil myself, but what I was saying oh hey to is hey, look, 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 it's me! I finally featured in the fan photos. <gasps> finally! And this was um, a look I curated using everything from the Kira Kira crate, so that is super duper cool. Anyway, let's grab something. What is this jewelry scrub? Oh, it's pure small and as far as I've um, experienced so far, Pure Small is actually a pretty damn good brand that I'm liking. Oh yeah, I'm going to smell it. Oh no, it's sealed. Okay, diamond scrub. Glitter, sh what? Glitter sugar scrub? Okay, let's see what my booklet says about this. Okay, it says, oh, so you could either got sapphire or diamond. We got diamond. So this says, this scrub will have you feeling classy and sophisticated. Each scrub contains a unique precious gem powder. Mmm. You'll either receive the diamond or sapphire scrub, both of which contain glittery sugar particles for exfoliating. They also have a wonderful sweet scent. Oh, <laughs> well I'm going to be having a bath later, so I will try that out. This is super duper cool. Like, I actually recently just brought an exfoliating scrub, so uh, I guess I'll just alternate between the two. Let's grab something else. Oh! This is cute! Okay, nail stickers, I'm guessing this is Minnie Mouse theme by the look of it. Um, as you can see, I've recently painted my nails, so I don't really need to do any nail stickers. Will my fingers fit? My fingers will fit. Ah, wonderful. This is super cute, though. I've never used nail stickers before, so I think next time I do my nails, I'll be using these. Uh, oh, oh, where is it? Where is it? It is, here we go. Disney Mickey Mouse, wait, Mickey Mouse? No. Disney Minnie Mouse nail decals. Minnie is always looking kawaii whether she's out on the date with Mickey or out on the town with Daisy. Whenever she's in Japan, she's also sure to have her nails done, as many Japanese fashionistas do, with sticker decals. These nail decals emblazoned, emblazoned? with images of Minnie's classic style and cuteness make manicures effortless and beautiful. Awesome, and the directions are cut each sticker, blah, 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 blah. Okay, I don't really need to read instructions, but I guess I'll be using that at some point. These look super cute. Oh yeah, pink isn't really my colour, but I mean, I'm willing to give anything a try. Next item, what is this? Oh, eyebrow powder? And there's also like a weird tubey thing inside. Oh, it's not focusing, sorry guys. Eyebrow powder? I mean... I actually do need eyebrow powder, so far I've just been using eyeshadow, so this is actually really useful, but... Cool, okay, um... Uh, Fua Marsh Eyebrow Powder, 03, Angel Baby. Keep your eyebrows on fleek with... <laughs> with his eyebrow powder palette, spe specially made for the perfect gradient brows, I see. The palette also comes with a template with three different eyebrow shapes to help you achieve your most flattering eyebrow shape. I see. You'll be cute as a soft marshmallow, which is the name of this brand, Fuwa Marsh. Oh, that's super duper cute. Okay, so I'm guessing that little roll of things I saw just now was the templates. Like, I don't really need a template because, you know, let's be honest, if you guys already know, my eyebrows are pretty damn snatched. But this is... 
the instructions on the back telling you how to do it. So you go through A, B, C, and I guess you just blend it. This is super cool, and I think it's in my shade. I mean, I'm not sure, but it's super cool. I didn't expect to get an eyebrow palette. So I am definitely going to be using this. Oh, now I was spoiled about this on my on the Instagram. This is shampoo and conditioner. I'll probably be giving this away because, as you guys know, I have extremely long hair, and it also needs specialist care to maintain its color. So this will be going to a friend, most likely. Uh, let's see. She Shiseido. Shiseido? Is am I saying that right? Super mild. Super mild. <laughs> shampoo and conditioner. Uh, cult favorites in Japan. Popular for the gentleness suitable for all hair types. It's especially great for those of us with sensitive skin. Oh, and fine hair. Vitamin E and other ingredients have been especially formulated to moisturize and protect hair, locking all important nutrients within your cuticle. The, the clean and mild fragrance make it perfect for all occasions. You know you can trust super mild because it also comes to you from Shiseido, Japan's leading luxury makeup brand. Ah, that's why I sound familiar. Loved by many for their attention to health beauty. What I just mean, I just swapped those two letters over. Okay. Okay. I think it's cute that that comes in a little case like this. Like, oh, that is so freaking cute. These bottles are so tiny though. Seriously, like I would use this. Just this bottle of conditioner would be just about enough to cover all my hair. So this will probably be going to a friend or into my prize pool. Boop. Okay, last item. No, second last, second last item. Whoa, what is this? Very, it's a bath thing. It's super powdery. Okay, let's see what it says. Uh, light Liebe uh, Milk Bath Salts Mango. <gasps> this mango scented bath will have you feeling like you're on a tropical island in summer in no time. Three moisturizing ingredients, lactoferrin, lactobalicus, and mango extract will also make your skin smooth and soft. Well, like I said earlier, I'm having a bath later, so I think I will be using this. And I freaking love mango so much. Oh, I know what this is. These are the face masks. Actually, um, which box is it? In the no, first No Make No Life box, they gave us an eight pack of the Sakura ones. So I'm very glad that I've got the green tea ones. Now let's see what my bookie let says. Yeah, because you could have either got the Sakura one or the green tea one. So I'm glad I got the green tea one this time. Uh, Hello Kitty face mask slash cherry blossom slash green tea. The Hello Kitty print on these masks is too kawaii <laughs> and they come in two different colours and scents. Pink with a cherry blossom fragrance or green with a green tea fragrance of which you'll receive one pack bonus. One pack is two masks of that colour slash scent. What? Uh, okay. Both masks also contain collagen and hyaluronic acid which will help to heal to moisturize improve the elasticity of your skin. Oh, awesome! Well, I'm actually going to use a peel-off mask, well, a peel mask, later for in my bath. So I will keep these around. I also find it so amusing how squishy these are. I love it. I love it. Okay. All right. Now let's just go through the rest of the bookie lip. Now at the beginning, it has all the contents and everything, and I'm so proud that I finally got into the images. <laughs> Hopefully, it will happen in the other boxes I'm subscribed to. And in the very end, it also gives you like a little mini makeup tutorial, so I will hold this here so you guys can pause that and read it if you want, which is it's usually pretty helpful because sometimes it includes um, the items they've given you in the box, so you can kind of use that. Okay, it's now the time of the video where I pick my favorite item. Now, to be honest, all this stuff is super cool. Um, We've, face masks seem to be kind of a staple in these boxes, which I'm not mad at. I'm quite glad because I love using face masks. And the nail stickers are super duper cool. And obviously this will be going in a prize pool because I don't... This is not enough for my hair. <laughs> and I think this is all super cool. Like, um, But I think because I don't have anything like it, I think I'm going to say that my favourite item is the eyebrow palette. Oh, it's focusing my arm. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to say that my favourite is the eyebrow palette because like I said, I've never had anything like it. And I think it is my shade as well. So... That is super duper cool. Um, if you guys are subscribed to this box, what was your favourite item from box? Let me know down below in the comments. If you're not subscribed, let me know what you liked as well. 
Um, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoy watching me unbox these. Don't forget to subscribe to me if you like because there will be future unboxings. I'm still waiting on my Doki Doki crate and my uh, No Make No Life crate, I think. Well, basically I'm subscribed to several subscription boxes, so if you want to keep up with that, please subscribe to me. Uh, all my social media links are down below, don't forget to check that out. Instagram is my most used social media platform. And um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed!